Hi guys, welcome back to From the Floor. We're gonna take a look at a few of the maintenance items on this compressor. So once you've pulled off the cabinet, you've got your oil filter, which needs to be changed at 2,000 hours or once a year. In the back, you have your air filter that also needs to be changed at every 2,000 hours or once a year. And then every two years or 4,000 hours, you need to replace your oil separator. Every 2,000 hours, you're gonna to need to do three main maintenance items on this compressor. You're gonna to need to replace the oil, you're gonna to need to replace the oil filter, and then you'll also need to replace the air filter. Now, like I said, that's every 2,000 hours or approximately once a year. On models with an integrated dryer, uh, there's gonna be two main maintenance items that you're gonna to need to look at. One is gonna be your condenser. Um, depending on how dirty your shop is, you may need to clean your condenser a little more frequently than most, but typically about once a month, you'll just need to take a little compressed air and blow out your condenser. Now, the other thing you'll need to look at is once a year, you'll need to either rebuild your auto drain or replace it. So as you've seen, there's a lot of easy maintenance items on this compressor, but if you have any questions, you can always visit us at www.cpcompressors.com or call our 800 number.